Hello viewers, greetings to you and welcome to my channel. This is a 320 watt solar panel. So I want to show you how to measure the open circuit voltage and the short circuit current of your panel. Now the open circuit voltage of a solar panel is the voltage that you measure from the solar panel when it is not connected to the load. We have the positive and the negative terminals of the panel. So when the panel is not connected to the load, to a load and you measure the voltage, that voltage is called the open circuit voltage, VOC. Then we also have the short circuit current. The short circuit current is a current you measure from a panel when that panel, you breach the terminals of the panel. That is, you connect the negative terminal of the panel to the positive terminal of the uh, panel. So when you connect them like that and you measure the current, it is called the short circuit current. Now, why do you need these parameters? These parameters will guide you in sizing your solar charge controller. So I'm going to show you how to you know, measure it. Now, on this panel, uh, you can see it here. It is, uh, I tried as much as possible to uh, slant it. It is 15 degrees and it is facing south. Now, if you are in Nigeria and you are installing your solar panels uh, for maximum uh, production of energy, you need to install them at uh, angle 15 degrees and they should be facing south. So what you, you use to get um, this uh, inst installation value is your compass inclinometer. If I place it here, it will give me the angle of uh, these uh, panels. So what I'm having here is 15 degrees and uh, from my cardinal point, it is facing south. So please come over so that uh, I'll show them how. All right, these are the uh, terminals of the solar panel. So to measure the open circuit voltage and the short circuit current of this panel, you need a digital multimeter or a clamp meter, any of them. So we are using digital multimeter. Please come closer. So if to measure the voltage, you need to set your meter. This is your meter. This is direct voltage and alternating uh, current. This side is AC. This side is direct current. So when you're setting your uh, digital meter, make sure you appropriately uh, place this knob. If you're measuring direct uh, current or voltage, this is direct voltage now, you place it here, you can see the symbol. Then this one is for alternating uh, current, that is AC power. Then this side is for uh, DC current and AC current. So we want to measure the DC voltage. So since the open circuit of this voltage is 45 volts, that's the open circuit voltage of this solar panel. So you make sure you place your meter above uh, 45 volts. So you can see it here, 20, I mean, uh, two volts, 20 volts, 200 volts. So since it is 45 volts, we'll place it at 200 volts. Then we now use our terminals. These are the probes of the meter. We now connect them to the terminals of the solar panel. You can see what is written there. What we have is 38.7 volts. That is what we have. That's the open circuit voltage of this panel. Now to measure the short circuit current, you can see these terminals, you're going to change it. You can see amps, 20 amps. It means this meter can only measure, uh, the maximum current this meter can measure is 20 amps. So I'm going to remove this red one and please here, since I want to measure current, I change it from here to this other uh, terminal. So after connecting it here, I'm going to place these probes at the positive and negative terminal of the panel. So whatever value I have is the short circuit current of the panel. Sorry, you first of all change this to current. The short circuit current of this panel is uh, 8.28 amps. So I'm going to place it at 20 amps. This yellow side is for AC. So let's take it again. All right, the short circuit current is 3.17. Uh, that minus is showing you that this place I place this positive probe is supposed to be negative. If I change them now, that minus sign will not be there again. So you can see it on the meter. It is 3.14 amps. So this is the open and short circuit current of the panel. So to know the power, the actual power of this panel now, what it can generate, you multiply this by the open circuit voltage. That is why we talk about the performance ratio of a panel. That the panel cannot generate 100% of its rated uh, uh, capacity because of other factors. Thank you for watching.